We were in Luxembourg. Luxembourg. L U X E M B U R G. Uh, it's a total new little place by itself. Uh, country, I dare say. City. Uh, yeah, Luxembourg. Christopher Columbus Day, mm -hmm. and it's, it's a it's a holiday. We not only no award, some jobs don't open, schools they don't teach, and and Catania is a city, not uh, west, not east, and they made a big like a, I think it's copper, I think it's copper statue of Christopher Columbus. A lot of people were mad. Mm -hmm. uh, he just came here and slaughtered all our Indians and all those and all that. Why we celebrated? Hey, brother. What you doing? Yeah. Yeah, you doing good, sir? Uh, uh, we're downtown Luxembourg right now.
somebody actually ringing those bells in that tower. I don't know what it is, but the sound is pretty good. In the front, about almost 20 foot long. You know, you got you got the the door itself. It was it was rock, but it had like it had like rock made. Uh, uh, what do you call this? Like faith, like, like fixers. Yeah. That when when it slide in, it would stay sealed. So it so would pull off if I if I like a earthquake happened, it would come off. And you have to crank it open to get it out. But it was empty. Like they don't know why it wasn't there. They think there was something important that they hit there the whole time. Like nobody knew about it until last year. The bike scene. We all bikers at the end of the day, but it's just a different situation. Oh yeah, with a sidecar. Motor Goosey. Don't see nothing like that in the States. All my skate park fans, that's their skate park. What a beautiful setting. They're doing construction right now, so you see all of these blankets and heavy plastic and everything, but just across the way, that's the skate park up under this uh, amazing bridge.
First, I want to say thank you to everyone that watches my videos, everyone that uh, shares my videos, and everyone that uh, tells everyone else about my videos. Uh, I am truly blessed to be able to go see these things. Um, being in France is amazing. And thank you, thank you, thank you to the people that made that possible. And thank you all for watching my channel. Please continue to support and share and like these videos and leave comments too. Thanks. are here in Har uh, Metz, France. You've got the Ducatis over there, uh, Harley Davidson, Metz. Uh, nice bikes, a lot of nice things here. So we're gonna go in and check the scene. Uh, the other Harley I went to, they had a road glide, but this one so far all I see is street glides. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see. I don't know if that's in production right there, as far as to say in the States, but uh, that's pretty neat there. Yeah, that is pretty neat there. Yeah, go, go, go. <laughs> so that's a street glide, two street glides actually. Uh, one has the 114. And uh, this one here has a 117. Stiff little seat, pretty, pretty slick. Uh, two in the one, exhaust. Really slick, really slick. Yeah, it's different, but slick. So, I know y'all gonna get tired of these toilets after a while, but I am. Um, they say toilet in France, we say restaurant in the US, but I am intrigued by the tiny sink. So that's it. Just enough to wash your hand. Let me see if I can get a clear shot of that. Yeah, that's it, just enough to wash your hand. And for those that know me, y'all know my hands are not big at all. Um, it's, just, it's just different. Uh, mounted on the wall. I've never seen that. So, uh, the decorations. Uh, beautiful color scheme. Uh, Y'all know where I'm at now. Just be sure you know where I'm at. All the things. Yeah. Yeah. So, like I said, it's just, it's just different. Um, different, very different from 
big thing we see in the States. African cuisine. I'm gonna try it. It's on the corner. My hotel is on the next block. But we're gonna try it. So I'll show you pics of the food in a second. Hey everybody. Uh, three or four. So as you can tell, I'm on the third floor of the building, and uh, pretty decent hotel, fairly new. Uh, it's basic, really, really, really basic, but I want to give you a room tour of uh, what it's like. So uh, let's see here, we're going to open the door. a little card in. So in most of all of the hotels here, when you come in the room, and that's how you cut your electricity up. I'm gonna do that again, just so you see. So of course I left my lights on uh, in the bathroom because it was early. It's the only one I left, but uh, uh, nice place this time. Um, no AC. I can go ahead and take it off the top. No AC. So, um, we have got toilet. It's hanging off the wall. Don't know why that's important, but anyway, I'm just giving you a tool. So, that's the uh, shower, tub, sink. And of course, I'm just coming in from work, so. You see me, a uh, little bathroom stuff, uh, you know. I'm from South Carolina. We believe in cleaning our own toilets. So these tablets, well, these are tablets. Uh, that is actually bleach and uh, lemon cleaner. They call them Mr. Popper, I guess. So yeah, these are uh, 
Let me see if I can get one open. Maybe not. It's a little tight. Forgive me. But. See these big tablets? That's Clorox. So you can buy it either in tablet form or you can, you can buy it in liquid form, but nevertheless, I thought the tablets would be easier to travel with um, since we're still moving around, um, going from place to place for our training. Um, this glass, so I know you saw that when I walked in. The neat thing about it is the glass opens up. Yeah. It's on the hinge and it opens up. So coming into the bathroom, let me step back out. That's the glass there. And it's a really small space. Uh -huh. When the glass is closed, I'll step back and let you see it. But you can bring the glass out, get in the tub, and it's, it's really deep. Uh, tub, shower, uh, combination. So uh, this is the heater. And you can't see it because I got it all covered up pretty much. but. There's the bottom of it, but that is the heater. And it is also your towel rack. So it dries your towels um, once you use them and put them back on it. And of course it's hot. Again, I'm here in uh, September, August, September. So it is a uh, little warm, but uh, it's pretty neat how it works. A uh, receptacle, uh, excuse the bad marks on the wall. Coat rack, uh, little kitchenette, there's a wall mirror. You got a refrigerator there and a uh, dishwasher there. And of course, a little sink area, um, light, microwave, uh, coffee pot, um, and a little two eye range. I haven't used it. I don't plan on using it because it's hot in here. I don't plan on cooking in here, but uh, like I said, there it is. So when you come on into the room, got a shelf there. Y'all see it. I found the Harley Davidson store in Luxembourg uh, yesterday. So of course I had to stop by there and get me some goodies. Uh, like I said, full length mirror. You know, we, we Harley boys now. So we gotta do, do what we do, cups. Um, TV, uh, of course there's only one channel that can be on that TV, the guy that can, yeah, you're right, you guessed it, ah, y'all so smart, y'all so smart, yeah, there's only one channel that's going to be on there, uh, YouTube, um, having to use Chromecast in here because, um, the internet, it's okay for your phone and your tablet, but it's not okay for, I bought my Fire Stick. So it's not okay for the fire stick, but uh, anyway. Um, radiant heat, again, uh, two chairs. So this chair here was actually right in front of this bar, as if to say like a table. And then um, maybe for taking notes or doing paperwork. And then this white chair actually goes with this white table. Now initially when I came in the room, um, I didn't have any place to put my suitcases, so I threw my suitcases over in that corner, and I moved the table so that I could have a place to put my, of course, my electronics, my computer, and uh, my uh, iPad, and that window's there. There's nothing to see out back. It's a brick wall. I will show y'all the view, but there is no view. Uh, but neither, nevertheless, um, that's the bed. Um, it's, it is low to the ground, it's pretty close. But pretty good size bed, and like I said, I just slid the table over to uh, where I could put my electronics, my phone, and what have you. Um, so let me see, did I get the lamp? There's a lamp in the middle of the room, and I've got, I think, the majority of the lights on in here, just to you know show you how it looks so it's not so dark. Um, there's a thermostat that's on the wall. It only works the heat, works nothing else. So uh, this. First little cabinet here is your electrical. And 
as you see that's your panel in there for all my electricians uh, that's pretty decent but we'll see <laughs> That's pretty decent for my, my electrician. And uh, here's a closet. Comes with a uh, ironing board. A little duck off corner, a little space here. Not much, but you can put a few things there. Um, like I say, I live out of a suitcase, so I don't ever really unpack. Um, I'm used to that. I've traveled all my adult life, so. Uh, these little lights here, these work too, little reading lights. Uh, so that's my setup. And uh, as I see now, I thought I reviewed my video pretty good, but I realized now I didn't. I left, I speeded some uh, video up just so it wouldn't take so long to see. Um, but I didn't detach the volume from it, so my bad. But anywho, uh, that's it. That's my little tour of where I'm at. And I am in Nancy. Uh, N-A-N-C-Y. Nancy, France. Uh, from what I understand, this used to be, or is, the home of the European Parliament here. So I guess you could say capital city. Um, it's capital city here. So, pretty cool. Ate at a really nice restaurant today. I'm gonna put all of this in the video. Um, we got off work and went and got dinner. Really nice restaurant, but I'm gonna put that in the video as well, the name and some pictures of the food that I had, so. All right, it's the guy that can, checking in.